Hey everybody, it's Dark Guardsman, we're back on another video. Now you would think I'd only have to make one bug of the day video when I'm working on something, but it's so easy when you're working on code that you have to debug and effectively reverse engineer because you have no notes to break it. Now the previous video, I had got the cluster missile kind of messed up on its trajectory. Now I have fixed it so that way the spawn point is correct so it will do a circle around the actual missile. That was being messed up by pretty much uh, this function down here, which I have to admit needs to be rewritten because it only does a theta angle, so we only get an X and Z out of here, and I flipped the Z with a Y by mistake, so we ended up with a different uh, flight path. Now, what I end up actually doing with this is actually probably pulling the angle data from the uh, missile itself and then calculating a good spread off that, so that way, depending on the angle where the missile is coming in, it'll spread a lot better and it'll look a lot cleaner and you end up with like a more of a shotgun spread rather than basically a donut shape which will be much more preferable um, but what is happening now as you can see is what I did is I was trying to figure out why the missiles weren't moving now they do default as a cruise missile um, which is a, a subtype it's not really meant to be named the same as a cruise missile in real life it's just meant to say that this missile was fired in a direct path it is mainly used by the cruise launcher in ICBM but the cluster missiles use that subtype as well the other types of course is launcher for the handheld and just regular missile for the regular missile launch from the uh, launch pads now I went and flipped it to the launch pad uh, type, and we can see this over here on the code here. So I switched the type right here, and just switching the type completely breaks the logic. Now I assume what's going on is that because I'm actually trying to uh, map a target position and it's trying to get to the target position, it's trying to do the arc pass. So for those who don't know how the arc pass system works, let me go ahead and launch a separate program here. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo, I believe we can just run, yeah, run and then hit main here. So I've got that visualization piece of software that shows the arc path simulation. So it basically, you click here, it'll do an arc. So what I'm thinking what's happening is I messed up my math somewhere. And what I'm assuming is going on is that this is our position here. And it's trying to arc up and we, I set the position to say like 100 above it or something like up here. It's trying to arc up to that. And it's falling back down, it's trying to arc back up to again, and it's falling back down, and it's repeating this process over and over again. That's what I think might be happening. Um, it's not exactly what's going on, and of course we got... Yeah, that's the math from that program right there. So, we're seeing some kind of behavior like this, and it kind of makes sense, because I think I, what I ended up doing was reversing the target position. Uh, I was grabbing the vector from the missile, because how this is supposed to work is when it is being launched from this handheld launcher like I'm using right now, and I fire this, it's supposed to grab the vector from the missile uh, and actually calculate 100 meters down to basically get down to bedrock and then make a, a position 30 meters around that for the missiles to go towards. Uh, of course, that's not happening. We're getting something completely different, so these missiles are effectively flying upwards. And they're teleporting back down, which makes no sense to me. So something tells me they're glitched out. They're moving maybe client or server side, or not moving continuously. It is creating for a really weird effect. I mean, this is like, if you wanted to do some kind of like promo video or something, this is kind of cool. <laughs> Have the missiles just coming up and down and teleporting going into the sky. I can imagine playing the song, I believe I can fly with these. But yeah, that's uh, another bug of the day here. So I'll see you guys in that later. Hopefully I'll fix it.